Hello and welcome to Panthe Plays Morrowind. I'm Natty, the Black Panther Kitty, and I'll be the host of this recording. Obviously, because I'm going to record more than one episode, I guess. So, first things first, let's levitate down from here. So we have been tasked by uh, Master Aaron to squash the monopoly of the Mage's Guild, for which we need to go to Aldrune, but I still want to have that stronghold. I do want, to, desperately do want to put my books somewhere. So I actually did a quick search on the webs, interwebs, to see where um, Lunella Hilaren is, and I found out that I seem to be too stupid, or to blind, I don't know, to find her because she's supposed to be at the very root of the mushroom that is the, um, the council hall. So let's try there again. We need to go, that's what I want to do. We need to go to Sedanin anyway. Because my, my route to Aldrun is uh, heading to Sedanin from uh, not Sedanin. Uh, Wolverine Hall is in Sedrith Mora. We're going to head to Sedrith Mora, go to the guild, take a guild, mages guild to travel, how ironic, to Aldrun, and then we'd speak to the council there. So for Sedrith Mora, and now we're basically where the council, how the council is. So we're going to drop by there and check if we can find Lunila Hilaren at what the wiki calls the Hermitage. Because I do want to get rid of all these books, I don't want to throw them away or sell them, I want to store them in my house. Being a powerful or being a powerful wizard or powerful wizard in Spain. If that's actually a thing you say in, in English, um, I of course need a big library. Sadly, I did not find any mod that has bookshelves in the way that you can put books in them and they get like rendered in the game. You can just put them there, but they will be lying, they will not be standing. I think for Oblivion there was a mod and um, Skyrim has that built in. So if it says the Hermitage is at the root, then we're going to want to head downstairs, not upstairs. Is there something I can do for you, Alcaro? Uh, not right now, thank you. Very helpful people here. Uh, also, one thing that I need to do at some point is create a little software that reminds me when I'm mumbling too much. So this does not look like an Hermitage. Is there something I can do for you, Alan? Oh, good. No, actually, you, you could tell me where the Hermitage is, but I don't think you can. Uh, you will see, no, I can't ask you where that person is that I'm looking for. But still, thank you for the offer. Still going to look here. I know that we've looked here already. Is there something I can do for you, Alan? So let's check the chambers. I think we just saw that there is some kind of uh, temple here and then turned around, I guess. Maybe we missed something. This is... Not... let me first check that room because I think there is a door at the end of the room. So this was, I think, the temple. You find all that you Do you have something to say, Outlander? Where is that snake? Doors of the Spirit, Fellowship of the Temple. Now let's check that room, because I think in the far end of this room there is actually a door. Maybe we May just need to head all that you see, through here. Yes, that's the door we missed, I guess. Very interesting. This is actually a cave. So this is... Is there any way to... To figure this, not to figure this out, is there any way to, to, to get a message or to go in the game? I mean, this is this is a major thing, getting the stronghold. 
Thank you. I've been told that um, I should discuss my stronghold with you. Yes, I can build you a tower of your own, spell right? First you must acquire a construction contract from Duke Vedam Dren. Then you bring me two strong souls to form the fo foundations of your stronghold. Ah, so the stronghold is going to be magically built. Let me real quick write that down. So I need to get construction contract from Vedam Dren. And I need to get two strong souls. Okay, and we have spoken with Lunilla Heron. So let's see about that construction contract. House Telvani has expanded too quickly. We have allowed our young and ambitious to build unauthorized bases all across Vardenfell. To avoid trouble with the Grand Council, you should make your stronghold official. Only Duke Vedon Dren and Ebenhard can issue construction contracts. That is very interesting. So we have. Uh, and go to Aben Hart. Get construction contract from. Wait, I'm, I know I'm repeating myself here. I, I entered the same thing, but uh, this the first one was like the, the title of, of of the quest, and now I'm adding the subtasks here and bring construction contract to Lunilla Laran in that was uh, said in Telvani Council Hall. And then we have the two strong souls. What about the two strong souls? Here, take these grand soul gems, fill them with the souls of suitable Daedra. The best souls are Storm Atronachs, but more powerful data such as Winged Twilights and Golden Saints will work as well. Ooh, that's actually... Okay. So, wire two strong souls in red soul gems. And bring Soul gems with strong souls to Nila Laren in Telvani Council Hall. There it goes. Thank you very much. Can you tell me something about yourself? Let me first have a little sip of um, of something to drink. If you don't have something to drink, go and fetch yourself. Pause the video. Go and fetch yourself something. If you do, take a sip yourself. Remember, stay hydrated, folks. I am the stronghold builder for House Telvani. Let me just make these. Okay, so I go. I go and use the terms, the, the stronghold thing, in order to hand in the stuff. Okay, and with no further ado, we're going to head to Aldrun to speak with the council about the power of the Mages Guild. May you find all that you seek, traveler. Well, thank you very much. That's very nice of you. I didn't know if this was the way upstairs or if I should have turned left. So I just checked, but this is the way upstairs. And here we go. Ah, come on. Yes. It felt like I was going to be stuck in the scenery or in the wall. These protrusions in the wall. Okay, now off to... Ald Rune and to the council. And here we are in Ald Rune, and we have a. Um, 
just go away. I'm recording here. And here we are in Aldrune. We have a rare weather condition. It is not a sand or ash storm, but instead it is raining. We've taken shelter under the shell of the council hall where we were headed anyway. What a coincidence. So let us head inside. I think that is the in the manor district is where the Aldrune council is. And we're just going to check. That's the guild hall of the Morak Tong. The, uh, an entrance to someone's house. And I guess it is the doors with the banners in front of them. The Red Oran Council entrance, there we are. And we were sent to, let us see, to convince Athen Serethi to support House Telvani. So to see where this person is. Well, none of, she, she doesn't not know. Right about you. Maybe you should go. I suppose you're looking for a tavern. I'm not very much liked here because I'm from a different house. So let us see. This is their council hall. Is a trader here. They, they have services in their council hall. Well, yeah, okay, okay. Our house does have services too, and enchantment and all that, obviously. That is not the name. Let me check again. Athens or Ruffy. I don't think I can just ask around. That is someone's house. No. And not the name that I was looking for. Let's check the map. No. No. Practice room. Let's check this end. This is also the practice room. Oh, and there is always two doors. What outlander? Well, I'm just checking out things, to be honest. So I guess I just need to check all the doors here. That's the smith. Because there are always two doors on top of each other. And, um... I don't important. guess this is where they sit and um, make decisions. Um, there are two doors on top of each other and you only see one of the doors on the map. This is the hostel of the council. So I guess if I would were to join House Redoran, I would be sleep be able to sleep here at some point. It's very nice, very nice walls actually. Let me see if I can ask someone. Um, why can I ask for a Rober Manor? That's interesting. She doesn't want to tell me where it is, but I don't actually care. That is confusing. No, it's not Andrano. It was Sarefi. I'm mainly looking for the last name. And yes, I know I'm. I am, I guess that's the same trader, I am a little bit confused here. Okay, let's check the upstairs. Let's first check if this is the smooth again. So I truly went, yes, I truly went all around. And then let's head upstairs and check the upstairs doors. So this would be the council entrance. This is basically where I came from. This is the practice room. This better be important. Okay, I guess the Red Oran are fighters then. Very interesting. 
Let's see. So there is another door, like a balcony here for the practice room. Galzakindu. Let's just check if there is more than one person in here. No, uh, that was not unexpected, but um, if you search for someone, you can't ask around. The only way is to just check everything. Goras Andrello, okay, there is a guard, there is... What is that no, that's not a guard, that's the owner of the house, and I guess that's their, that's his wife. Um, but we're intruding, so we're just going to leave again. This is another balcony. Gulz Lelervu, I, I know that name. Um... Why can I ask for Arabar Manor? This is, is... Is this the place I'm supposed to go, maybe? Let us check. So there's people walking around. So these are guards, as expected. And then there's... Looking for a tavern. I'm sure I can get you. Well, these are not connected, so let us, let us check because I think this manor was here. And it could be that this is the house that you get. That one that one caught me by surprise. It's the house that you will get um, when you join the house of Radaron. No? It is actually what? here. Lots of guards here. I'm sure I can. Interesting house with just filled. Okay, guard quarters. Watch out, Lander. I think this game does not have the concept of trespassing as the follow ups have. So you can just walk everywhere. You are allowed to be everywhere, but you can't. You can't do anything. So stealing still is a thing. Nope. This better be important. Private quarters. I still think that this is the place that you will get when you when you rise in the ranks. What is it, peasant? But still no sign. I, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm just in the wrong searching in the wrong place. That, that was the exit. And it was here. Guard quarters. Ah, okay, so this is this is like the exit for going around. No, the master bedrooms. Okay. That's minor Arabar. That's that's the owner of the place. And of course they don't like me. I mean I'm from a rivaling house. Yeah, this is this is the Arabar family here. But we are looking for Ethan Serethi. And it was said that they'd be part of the Redoran of the Great Council. Am I, am I missing something? Am I mixing things up? I thought this was the Great Council. Let me check the journal. The councilmen of House Dredoran. I must get at least three of them to agree to revoke the major skilled. Okay. If you can convince all three, we will. I would start with Etherin Sarathi. He seems to be the most open minded. Okay, so we can. In the end, we can also talk with other counselors. Counselors, counselors. How do you pronounce that? The people, councilmen. So we just go back here into the council entrance and check back with the with the people living there. 
or maybe it's their offices. I mean, we let's start with the upstairs. So that was the practice room, and I guess this person is not a council right member. I'm sure I can't help you. Um, what's your trade? He is a master at arms. Okay, that was the balcony. Let's check downstairs. I have already forgotten wh where what is. This is the smith, I guess. Quickly or some worker at the smithy. Much time. And she is the I smith. More vein quarters. I suppose you're looking for a tavern. So I'm I guess sure more vein. Mistress Brara Morvane, and we can ask her about her background. My husband was a counselor of House Redoran. He died defending our manor from blighted monsters. I now hold his seat on the council. Well then, what do you think of the Mages Guild, Monopoly? No, why would I aid the Telfani? Get out of my manor! What, Outlander? Well, I can I can change that. I can change that. Cause I can fortify my personality in a ridiculous way. See, now you like me. And I guess it does not stack, does it? Oh, no, it does not. Okay, so she's not ready. Either either we need to be more than 75% or she's not ready. Let's try the others. For example, this person who does not seem to be because of the major skill thing is not here. This better be important. Well, it is, it is. Um, I don't know if the hostel is empty, but I'm just going to check the manners for now. The houses. So this, for example, is... Not someone I who is... You're looking for a tavern. I'm sure I can't help you. Who are you? What's your trade? She's an agent. It's interesting how willingly everyone tells you their Less occupation. See if there's someone else at the trader. No, it does not seem so. And I guess the trader is also not a council member. Nope, he isn't. Okay. What now? I suppose yeah, this is a bit frustrating to be honest. I'm is there a hidden right. door here? No. And I guess there's also not with the smith. Yeah, she was just the smith. Okay, upstairs, the practice room above the smith. There's another house. Let's see. Oh, I can ask her for a construction contract. Better make her like me. Uh, Ma'am, I'm here to, uh, to speak of, about a construction contract. Here on Vardenfell, the Duke must issue a construction contract. Oh, shit. Change the wise. Here on Vardenfell, the Duke must issue a construction contract before we lay the first founding stones for any building. This rule is often overlooked by the Halalu and Tervani, but House Redoran is honorable and will not break these rules. So I guess she's the house builder for the, the home builder. Something like that. Uh, 
And there's another house. Uh, oh, she has lots of things to ask for. And there is the major skill, but not the major skill, uh, Monopoly. Interestingly enough. What is it important? Hmm. This is not as easy as I expected. Can't even ask around to find the people. What about him? Uh, where is the my trade thing? Can't even ask him who he is. Priest and lawman. Okay. Uh, what? There was someone walking around back there. Let me check if she has the uh, dialogue option. No. Seven and lawman. I don't want to join the house because I can only belong to one house. It's really bad. Honestly, I already have forgotten where things are. I want to go back to the entrance, yes. Okay. So maybe they are living in the city. Let's check. We can check that, that place. Oh yes, okay, I'm a stupid. The entrance to their house to Sarethi's house is right here. So I think it was Yeah, that one. That one here. So let's see. So this is the person we're supposed to talk. Oh, no, this is Ethan Sarethi. It is Ethan Sarethi. Yes. See, I come to talk about um, the major skill mon monopoly. I do not trust you. I don't even like you. Why should I listen to you, Telvani? Well, the liking can be changed. Yes, I see your point. The Mage Guild Monopoly is unfair. I will support this resolution to overturn the, the Mage Guild Monopoly. Perhaps you could convince the other councillors with an appeal to fairness. The only councillor who would never support this resolution is Archmaster Bolvin Venom. Appeal to fairness? You may be able to convince the other councillors if you use an appeal to fairness. House Redoran does not approve of all that House Telani does. But we are proud of our record of just and fair dealings with the other great houses. The other councillors may be easier to persuade if you take this approach. Okay, thanks for the thanks for the hint. There we go, we need three of them. And we're just going to go from door to door, I guess. Let's see, so this is the next place. And we can't do the appeal to fairness here. Watch out, Landa. So I guess we're talking with the wrong person. Let us go deeper into that place. Let's search every nook and cranny for the person we're looking for. Yes, they people. might be. They might be hiding behind this tapestry. Okay, so no, there is nothing here. Let's not dig, but walk deeper. I am Halarun Moran, Lord of Westgash and Councillor of House Redoran. Who exactly are you? Well, I'm here to appeal to fairness. 
Your words are unconvincing. Yes, you say this law is unfair, but how can I trust it, Alvani? If you show me that yourself are honorable and fair, I will listen to your words again. This better be important. Is this may be honorable and fair? Your words have convinced me. Though it is rare that I agree with the true Talvani proposal, I will agree to this. 